it's an interesting question that keeps coming up. How old is too old to start MMA in today's era? And it's relevant that you look at today's era, right? Because don't forget, Randy Couture started MMA at 34 years old. Went on, became how many time world champion? He won three world championships, but had his first fight at 34. Now, of course, there was a little bit more to that story, right? He had 20 years of world-class wrestling. He had that background. I was teammates with a guy, Matt Horwich. And Matt Horwich went on, he got a black belt in jiu-jitsu, the IFL, if you'll recall that. He became their world champion. He had a great career, and he had absolutely no background. Started at 26 years old, but he had a work ethic like you wouldn't believe in. He was athletic. He was just one of these guys that passed through junior high and high school, and no coaches recruited him and pulled him into any team. No basketball, no football, nothing. Yeah, he just, he was kind of one of these social, uh, social misfit guys that would go and do other activities. But he had incredible DNA and he had a work ethic like he wouldn't believe. And he was able to start a little bit later. Now, there, I bring those guys up for nostalgic reasons, but not as part of my argument. I do think it's a new sport now. However, so many so many places around the country, we're now seeing kids starting in MMA, not going into any other discipline to start with. No, just pure boxing, pure you know wrestling with the local high school or jujitsu, just MMA, just within its own sport. They're even finding little circles and putting on the appropriate padding and sparring around a little bit. I don't know that I agree with that, that that's going to translate over time. We're going to have to wait and see. I don't know that I agree that that's going to translate over time because I think that's too small, and I don't think you do get the competitions. You know, the great thing, a lot of people will tell you it's practice and being in the practice room. Well, those people that are telling you that also own gyms and are looking to sign up memberships. If I could have one thing, which is I never practice, but I compete every single Saturday. Or I never compete, but I practice every single day. You are much better off to go out and compete. It is a totally different feel, and it's a whole different world. So for some of these young kids that are coming up in purely MMA, I don't even fully know what that means. And maybe in some countries it means something different than it does here in America. But in America, there is no scene, there is no circuit, there is no sparring, there is no competition, there is no weigh-ins for anybody under 18. We just don't have that. Even our amateurs must be... 18 years old, and I would stress and encourage the competition above everything else. The guys that are the really great fighters that you see on TV, you will always think, okay, I need that skill set. I need to know how to spin and kick a guy in the stomach or stand on one foot and you know, kick the guy in the head or throw the... That's what you see on TV, but the guys that are getting their hands raised and the guys that have the championships and the guys that are closing out the night are just really good competitors. The sport could be anything. As long as it's grueling and tough and has to do with heart, those guys that you want to be like can play. They understand how to compete. So whenever you want to start MMA, whatever age you want to do it, don't take your eye off the ball and think that you're going to be a great fighter because you were in the gym. I know guys like us all the time think they know how to box because they go and hit mitts every day and boy, do they look good doing it. Or they think they're in shape. It's a, it's a totally different deal. Hitting mitts is a very small piece of a training session, hitting a heavy bag, important pieces, small pieces, most important thing, have a partner, have an opponent in front of you, push and pull, struggle, learn from it. 